now today I'm here with the next first impression of one of the new cutie palettes and this is Metropolitan and it comes in this plastic little box as the other one and this one is <laughs> number four it looks like this I really like the front of it and <laughs> I especially like this little ghost right here I really really do but I think this is such a nice palette and it looks the same on the backside with a little ghost. So yeah and it is six shades in this one as well. I am so intrigued to use like this gold one and also this. So I actually think I will swatch this as I did with the other one and these are two mattes and four shimmers but I think that the shimmers are different formulas but I will swatch this and we will see how the gold one looks I think this one is a tougher shade I really I don't even think you can see it that was nice okay and the gold one but no one has swatched it. It looks like more than a bronze. So this I feel it's just like a topper shade. But this one. Oh. I really 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 like it. And I like this one as well. It looks like it has a um, silver sheen to it. <laughs> I hope you can see this. And yeah I... <sighs> First, I was really, really sure what I want to do. Now I am not. But okay, I will <laughs> stare a little bit more at the swatches, prime my eyes, and then start with makeup. And I have no idea what I want to do right now. So I will start with nothing. Whoop, people. Uh, with nothing personal in my crease, and I think I'll deepen it down a little bit with Lord. And I hope. I know that this is going to be very bright pink for it at least feel like it. We will see. Maybe not super pink, but yeah, okay. I can really build this up. Yesterday I filmed with the platinum 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 it has to be um palette and i have like glitter specks from that silver shade in that one like all over my face up in my eyebrows and i thought i had like got all the way yesterday um but no i really like this shade I've like been, I want to do something pink all the time now. I don't know why. Maybe I just have to take out a super pink palette and do something pink. I don't know. I really like this shade more than I thought. But now I want to go in with Lord and deepen this crease down a little bit. Maybe that is not a good idea, but guess what? I'm doing it and okay I maybe took too much on the brush okay no this works I really like this shade on the pink one maybe it takes away like all the pink so it's not that bright anymore but I actually feel like I like it and I've started to use a new eyeshadow primer. I have used the Urban Decay Primer po Potion. I think like the original and I have not been thrilled with that one. Now I have the Milani eyeshadow primer and I, I think I like this more. And I know maybe it is like 
dumb idea to take a new eyeshadow primer with a new eyeshadows, but I have played a lot with Nabla's eyeshadows before, so I think I know how they work. Okay, something like this and nothing to complain about. Now I think I just want to take Love Resin. Love Resin. <laughs> this one and slap it all over my lid. Do yeah, I want to. And this felt really good and it swatched so good and I really like this color. I think this should be like this. It's not a shimmer and it's not a matte. And I know that I should really like maybe study a little bit before I do my first impressions when I have palettes that are different um, formulas in them. Okay, this works so good with the Lord I had in my crease, deepen it down. It really deep. Okay, I want to go in with the pink one just a little bit here. Okay, this I have on my lid. Such a nice shade. It's like matte but it's not matte and shimmer but it's not shimmer <laughs> did you get any of that i really really like this okay easy as that i think i will just have it like this i think though i maybe want to take this this one alaska in my inner corner and also a little bit over this i have on my lid I'm not sure, but I will do my face and then do my lower lash and then we will see. So yeah, so far I really like this. I love the shade I have on my lid. So I will fix my base and then I come back and we do the under eyes and see where we will pop this topper Alaska. Looks so nice. So yeah, I will do that and then I come back. Okay, so for my lower lash, I think I will go in with this one and then take this darker shade. So I will start with the pink and like really smoke it out on my lower lash. Like that, and then go in with the darker shade just to have it a little bit darker closest to my lash line. Okay, and then I actually want to go in with Alaska, and I don't know if I want to take my finger or not, but I think I will start at least with my finger. Thinker. My finger in my inner corner. Okay. I really like this. And then I actually want to have it on my lid. I take it with a brush and just they like ooh, on here and it works really good and just like in the beginning and somewhat faded a little bit Okay, I really like this. So I will put on mascara, something in my waterline, and a lippy, and then I come back with my first little like 
first impression review with the Metropolitan palette from Nob. Okay, so like lipstick number four and I hate to choose like I hate to do another lipstick because the lines of the lips just getting worse and worse and worse. But okay, for my what line I used Get Paid from Colourpop. For my lips I used Rosewood from Anastasia and I think it's so hard to find a lipstick to like a more pinkish look if this is a pinkish look because I have like not any good like pink lipsticks but yeah this is my first impression with the Metropolitan palette from Nabla it is an amazing palette it works so so good I really 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 like this shade so I have used four of these six shades. So I used all the three in the top row and also this one. This, these two look amazing and it will, it is going to be so fun to use them. I think maybe pairing this with a black one would look amazing. But yeah, I really like this. I like all of the cutie palettes that I have tried. I think though I liked the one that I tested before this more. Even though I thought that this was like more my colors. But yeah, I really like it. It's a good palette. It's sleek. It's nice. I like the size of it. It feels sturdy. It's it's so clean and so good. And this little ghost thing the best thing ever so yeah this was my first impression with a metropolitan palette from Nabla and I I didn't say this in the other video but I feel like with this cute palettes you should just if you want to try them just buy the one that has the colors you like the most because I have tested out four out of five now and I feel that all of these four are so so good and I really hope that the last one is going to be good as well. It's just different colors, it's the same amazing formula on all the fours I've tried, so yeah. I really hope you like this video. I will see when the last is coming up with the Wildberry palette. Wildberry? Wildberries. Wildberry. and <laughs> wildberry palette but yeah i really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel please do so you don't miss any of my videos and i hope i'll see you in the next one bye